But, I mean, let's talk about the big news, the literal big news here today. Shaq debuts on AEW Wednesday. Shaq will be addressing AEW with Tony Schiavone. That is one of 10 segments scheduled for this show. They've only announced nine, but I'm pretty sure there's going to be a 10th. So, this is what's coming on tomorrow on Dynamite, okay? NXT is coming off TakeOver. They've announced zero things. Dynamite has 10 things announced. Tony Schiavone interviews Sting. The Inner Circle Ultimatum. They will either unite as one or they will break up forever. Shaq will address the AEW audience. Not the universe, the audience. Orange Cassidy versus MJF for the Dynamite Diamond Ring. AW Tag Team Champions, the Young Bucks versus Jack Evans and Angelico. It is a non-title match. And so Jack Evans and Angelico, they must win to get a tag team title match. Unlike in WWE where Lana, get this by the way. I don't want to get going on Raw yet, but Lana and Asuka beat Nia and Shayna two weeks ago. True. Lana and Asuka beat Nia and Shayna again a week ago. So, yes. first off, they won a non-title match, and they were rewarded with another non-title match, okay? They won two non-title matches, which led to an angle last night where Lana said, if we won the titles, if we won the tag team titles, we would have achieved the impossible. Impossible? You won two weeks in a row! So this is a stupid storyline. But anyway, Lance Archer, Penta, and Ray Phoenix will face Eddie Kingston, The Butcher, and The Blade. FTR versus Griff Garrison and Brian Pillman Jr. Dustin Rhodes versus 10. Abaddon in action. And an interview with Kenny Omega. So that's 10 segments scheduled for AW Dynamite on Wednesday. And we will see how the show does coming off the debut of Sting and everything they did on that big show. Everybody wondering if they'll break a million. That's hardly the most important thing, but we'll see what kind of follow-up they have this week to their big show last week. Mike, any thoughts on Dynamite? Or it'll, it'll be an important. <laughs> it'll be an important thing if it hits a million. That that's for sure. Um, Hey, yeah, I wonder when it comes to the Young Bucks and uh, Evans and Angelico, and Angelico, if because they've hyped up the fact so much that it's a non-title match and if TH2 gets the victory, then they're going to get the title shot that I haven't seen FTR in a while. And I would, I'm not saying that I would love to, for TH2's sake, to see FTR jump in there and cause them some sort of harm or something like that but i would like to see ftr kind of back in the mix here i don't know if people are as excited as i am to see they and the young bucks face off again i'm sure there's a lot of people that would love to see the young bucks now just go through a series of you know whether it be top flight or the acclaimed or th2 or no matter who it is and you could almost do like a team of the week putting on a showcase match i'm sure there's a lot of people that would love that but i would love to see them still tied in with ftr for right now because i think that's been great so i don't know what's going to happen in that match when it comes to sting and Shaq. i mean great the nba season is starting uh i'm sure there's going to be synergy on tnt and uh the nba and aew so this is going to fit in perfectly you have the sting announcement they have a card all loaded up you have kenny omega doing something tonight on impact so you know, I, I have no idea what AEW fan may be lingering on the edge about being able to see the show tomorrow. But if you're a big Kenny Omega fan and you don't have a chance to see Impact or you don't have the availability to, to watch Impact, you know, there's going to be that. So it, it's all loaded up and things are looking again. I don't know what AEW is going to do. You can let me know if they have anything planned already to try to counter this. I know they don't have 10 segments set up. Are you but, mean uh, NXT? It's going to be real hard again for NXT. You know, they're one of these groups is sniffing a million and trying to get to that point and, and be there on a consistent level in the 900,000s. And the other one cannot get to 700,000 uh, when they are not uh, when when they're opposed by AEW. So 
you know, this is still going to be hard times. If you're a big fan of these video clips here on YouTube, you're missing out on full-length shows. Down there on the bottom right-hand side of the screen, click that Join button, and when you sign up, you'll have full access to all of the shows that we've got up on YouTube, over 300 at current count. Wrestling Observer Live, The Brian and Vinny Show, and Figure Four Daily with Filthy Tom Lawler and Lance Storm. Hit the Join button, sign up today. You can also click Subscribe, and you'll always be alerted as to when new shows and clips are available.